Hello everyone and mga bebes, this is Mars. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And for today's video, ipifilm ko ko ngayon ang aking paggamit ng Curline Full Face Makeup using Curline Cosmetics or product. So this is also a 38 pesos edition. So 38 pesos each po ang bili ko dito. So yung iba na bili ko siya sa Shopee, yung iba sa Watson. But itong palette nila hindi po to 38 pesos. This is 38% discount. So, disclaimer lang, hindi ako makeup artist. At higit sa lahat, hindi to sponsor. Kasi 38 pesos na lang, i-sponsor pa ba yan? <laughs> okay. So, yan. So, what I have here, ayan, itong mga product na to. Kahit paano ay makakabuo ko ng full face makeup ni Caroline. Semi. Kasi itong aking kilay at ang aking lipstick is from Chris Cosmetics. Since wala din ako naabot ang makeup nila, only lipstick and brow liner na nag na lang, yun lang naabot ang ko. So, kahit paano, makakabuo pa rin ako ng full face makeup. So, let's start and try this product on my face. So, I already prepped my skin. So, what I will do now is to apply primer using the primer from Careline. Ito ang kanilang blur stick. So, I'm going to apply first a primer. Then applying primer on my skin. So after applying primer on my face, nakita niyo naman na medyo nag light or nag blur ng aking mga pores at aking mga oil dyan sa mukha. Before I'm going to apply eyeshadow, maglalagay muna ako ng powder. Imamat ko muna ang aking mukha using the Caroline All Control Face Powder. So imamat ko lang yung aking mata. Yan. Using their powder. Yan. Next step is maglalagay muna ako ng eyeshadow using this product. So, previously, this is 320 pesos. Now, 38%. Siguro, masa 198 pesos na ang bili ko. At ito ang itsura niya. Yan. So, ang ganda, diba? Ito yung mga shades. In fairness, mabango yung... <laughs> Mabango yung eyeshadow para siyang full boss. Yan. So, wala siyang salamin. But then, ang ganda kasi, meron siyang 12 eyeshadow, 4 yung glitters, and 8 yung matte. And then, meron siyang dalawang blush on and highlighter. So, yan. So, my favorite color, I'm going to use this as my transition eyeshadow. Itong color na to. Uy, napowder na siya. Then, next is I'm going to use this shade na to, itong shade na red, using this type of brush. So, siya yung lalagay ko dito. Apply. Kulay siya agad. Pigmented yung color niya, in fairness.
fairness, ang ganda niya, ang pigmented niya. Then, next is, I'm going to use this one. Gagamitin ko na lang yung kamay ko. I'm going to use this one, itong nasa dulo na glitter. Yun yung, yun yung ilalagay ko sa gitna. Uy, ang ganda. <laughs> ang ganda ng glitter niya. I love it. What I like about this eye palette is super pigmented when it comes to this red eyeshadow. Nakuha niya yung gusto kong pagka-red. And also, yung glittery niya is talaga naman mag-glitter talaga siya. So, sobrang kaling. So, what I will do now is go back again with my transition eyeshadow para yung glitter is hanggang dun lang sa talukap ng aking mata. Yan. And go back with the color red. Next is, I'm going to apply the color red dito sa ilalim na aking mata. Then, yung color orange kanina yung aking ginamit sa transition eyeshadow. I'm going to use this highlighter, yung highlighter na meron sila dito sa aking lap. I'm going to do this, this side. Now, I'm done apply eye makeup or eye shadow sa aking mata. Next step is maglalagay na ako ng kanilang liquid makeup or hindi ko ano kung tawag dito kung parang BB cream or foundation nila. But then, I have three shades. I have this natural almond and soft base. So, yung soft base, ito na yung kanilang new packaging. Naabutan ko yung new packaging. In order ko to sa Shopee at medyo nataganan sila pag-deliver sa akin. Hindi ko alam bakit. Siguro dahil yung soft base is naubusan na ako ng stock. Kaya ang nakuha ko yung bagong manufacture date which is last year. Yan, 2020. Dahil itong isa, ang manufacturing date is 2019. 2019 yung manufacturing date niya. So, um, naswertehan ko pa kahit paano, diba? So, I have three shades. Bakit? Kasi dahil summer ngayon, may tendency na mag-iba ang aking skin tone. Baka bas umitim. At least, meron ako extra shades. At ito ay only 38 pesos. So, this time, I'm going to use first the natural one. And this is comes with 15 ml. This is paraben free, cruelty free, and vegan. And pag binuksan mo siya, 18 months ang itatagal. Ay, mag-focus ng camera. I'm going to apply on this area. Yan. Na-apply ko na on this area. And then, I will apply on this area. At yan. Na-apply ko na on this area. So, ang liig pa. So, next step, I'm going to blend this liquid makeup on my face using this microfiber blending sponge from O2O. Essential na, natanggal na yung aking fake nails. But, okay lang. Lalaban ko yan. So, I'm going to blend this area. So, Since I'm done blending this area, I'm going to bless. I'm going to blend with this area. I am done blending this area. This time, I'm going to blend this area na nandito sa akin na o. And I am done blending liquid makeup dito sa akin forehead. Yan. So, pati yung leeg ko, hindi na may ko na nablend ko na rin siya. So, next step is to apply concealer. Wala akong concealer na nabili sa Caroline. So, this time, I'm going to use Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade medium. Yan. So. When it comes to blending concealer, i-blend nyo muna ng kamay nyo para bas, uh, bas ano siya, absorb doon sa inyong under eye lang. So, i-blend nyo muna siya using your fingertip. Yeah. 
bago nyo gumipo nitong microfiber blending stage. I am done blending concealer on my face. Next step is to set my foundation and concealer. Not foundation, liquid makeup and concealer using hairline powder. Yung ginamit kong powder kanina to set my eye para sa aking eyeshadow. Ito din yung powder na gagamitin ko to set my liquid makeup and concealer. And and this is in the shade Honey. Honey yung shade niya. I'm done concealing my face. Next step is to contour my face using contour stick. So I'm going to contour my forehead. Yeah. And then also contour this area. Yeah. And then I'm going to contour with this area. Yeah. So na contour ko na. Kung mapapansin nyo, medyo mataas ako mag-contour. This is to give illusion para magmukha mag-face lip ang aking mukha. Yung maangat. Hindi siya mukhang sad. So, medyo inangat ko tayo. Doon sa tenga ko. Hindi siya pa-drag down. So, ganyan nga ako mag-contour sa aking mukha. Next step is to blend this contour on my forehead. I'm going to blend this side. And then, this side, I'm going to contour my nose naman. I'm going to blend this contour on my face. Then I'm going to contour this side and I'll be back. Now I'm done contouring my nose. Next step is maglalagay na ako ng setting powder using the Caroline powder in the shade Honey. will be to apply blush on. I have two kind of blush on. I have peachy glow and I have this star like shine. So, check ko muna. All control blush on. Better than basic. So, it comes up with a pop. So, medyo dark to pagkakalam ko. So, test ko muna siya. Hindi siya bagay sa makeup ko ngayon. Kasi makeup ko ngayon, ang lakas maka-fresh. This one is a peach glow. So, try natin itong peach glow. So, ito ay... Parang wala lang. Try ko. In fairness, hindi ko siya gusto. Hindi siya bagay sa makeup ko ngayon. What I'm going to use is on na meron dito sa palo. So, ito katampit na ito. Somehow, gumagay siya sa aking mukha. So, after applying a blush on on my face, as you will see, maganda naman yung blush on na nandun sa palette. Bagay siya doon sa aking eyeshadow. Next step is to apply a highlighter. What makes me confused is because merong highlighter dito sa palette and meron akong dalawang highlighter stick dito sa care line. Meron akong strobe stick and beam stick. So, itong beam is manufacturing date na swertahan ko rin is 2020. At ito yung bago nilang packaging. Hmm. In fairness, ang ganda niya. Nakas maka-fresh. Promise.
So I'm done applying highlighter on my face using this beam stick from Caroline. So ang ganda niya. Ang lakas niya mukha fresh. Fairness. <laughs> In fairness naman. So what I will do now is maglalagay lang ako ng eyeliner, false eyelashes, and I'll be back. And I am back. I am done applying um, eyeliner and also naglagay na rin ako ng false eyelashes. Yung medyo simpleng false eyelashes lang nilagay ko para makita pa rin yung ginawa kong eye makeup. Kasi ayoko na hindi nakikita yung ginawa kong eye makeup. Sayang at maganda para man siya. So this time I'm going to apply lipstick. So ang lipstick, dahil wala akong lipstick sa Caroline, so ang gagamitin ko is yung Chris Cosmetics. Ang maglalagay muna ako ng lip liner. This is in the shade Vogue Diva. Then I'm going to apply this Let Go from the crease. So what I like about the product from this um, lipstick is matte talaga siya. Matte na siya. <laughs> Yan. So, uh, mag lang ako and I'll be back. Pasok natin si Sean. akong full face makeup using Caroline which is yung 38 pesos edition nila. So, nakabuo ako ng another look. Medyo may, para sa akin, medyo fresh look kasi nagamit ko yung orange and red tone na kung saan, ang ganda ng pinalabasan. So, pwede siyang gamitin sa pag-attend ng bridal kasi <laughs> nagpa-practice na ako dahil atin ako ng kasal ngayon. Ating friends, nagpa-practice na ako kung anong makeup na babagay this coming summer. Sana lang hindi pandemic or hindi isik yung time na yun. So again, um, kung nagustuhan nyo itong video ko, please comment down below kung meron kayong mga suggestion. And also, kung bago ka lang sa video ko or sa YouTube channel ko, please do like, subscribe, and click the notification bell button para updated ka sa mga upcoming videos ko. Thank you for watching. Bye!